Dragon Ball is back. This comp is back, and who better to bring it back to Korea in 2016 than the team that pioneered it, the Rocks Tigers. Yeah, this is going to just kill turrets so fast. And uh -oh. wow, are we actually going to see a dive? Gorilla knocked under turret. They make the play. Nuclear gets very, very low. There's a cocoon. Peanut comes in for the execute. First blood. Gorilla is... Spectre's cow for a little bit of defense already, and we'll just be happy farming underneath the turret while he can't... Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I don't know, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> was... why did he... Okay, so they see the dragon going on. Flawless can fight this. They're bringing Sasan in as well. Peanut in a lot of trouble. You're taking some damage from the dragon, but here comes Kuro. Oh, Kuro. the dragon's attacking him. That's right, and they get the kill. And now Gorilla all over Sasan as well. Secret comes in to try to help. Repel comes down, delivering Peanut to safety. Okay, coming over uh -oh. again. All right, nuclear slowed down by the pillar. There's the arcane shift still. Not enough to get him out of there. Use the flat. And that's one that Spenu can't quite contest. Peanut is so good. Yes, he is. <laughs> he can even send Soul coming in on him. And where's the wall? Oh, the oh, ult no! used by Grox to push him away. Gorilla comes in. Teleport brings Smeb to the party too. Big wild growth. They get the knock up Soul. Sausin secret on the run. Soul just knocks away. Does fall. Smeb shows up, finds Soul and Flawless. Tries to go for the Rift Herald. He's going to slow him up. Give Peanut time to get there. And Flawless taken down again. Oh, the hook! He tried to get away. But he got caught. The hook! Brought him back in again. Soul in big trouble. Wow, that was done, but clear out the wave. Peanut's job is to take out more dragons. All right. Sausage very, very low. Flawless turns around onto Gorilla, who gets low. They get the turret. Secret comes in for a big knockup, but doesn't survive long enough. He had no ult cooldown. Kuro had to ult himself, but it doesn't look like it really matters. Prey able to get so much health back. Getting the double kill, he may get more as Soul and Nuclear run. Soul comes back in. That's a double kill now for Peanut. And meanwhile, Snap jumps on a nuclear flash from Prey for the triple, and that's the dive that goes two turrets deep. It's just insane to watch these guys play League of Legends right now. They are so... My mind is just, like we mentioned earlier, the trust between these players, you know? Everybody knows that they're going to do oh the job. My. Somehow, people have no other team. It's unbelievable how good they are right now. You know, I, it's kind of too bad they're not going... Liver of a chance. It doesn't seem that way. Flawless caught again, takes a ton of damage. Prey just destroys people now. Welcome to the new wide world of Kogma. Prepare for that champion to be banned for every game for the rest of eternity. I mean, when you leave Lulu up and you don't take Kogma in the first round of the draft against the Tigers, what do you expect? You know what's Flash coming. Flash Cocoon, Sausen blown up. Soul on the run now, too. Smab comes in with the teleport. Soul knocks it back into the turret. Doesn't stop Prey from picking up the double. And the Rocks Tigers at 23 minutes. Look at Prey just going right into the fountain almost for the damage. They may be ready to end it right here. Looks like they are. And we may have one of the fastest, if not the fastest game this season. 24 minutes and there is nothing that Spenu Sonic Boom can do. There goes the Nexus. 24 minutes, 12 seconds. GG. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting performance. Beautiful. From the Rocks Tigers. At the end of the...